All right, welcome to the channel, Luis Bedoya, the Charles of the Real Lady. I don't have a gimbal today. In this channel, I show you, I show you Airbnb properties that are actively on the market. They're up for sale, and we know that these homes are great for regulations, are within the price point that we're looking at, and they have a great potential of making between 100 to 125 thousand dollars a year. So let's go ahead and take a quick look at this house. This is in a neighborhood called Parkview State. It's a cul-de-sac community with 150 acres worth of park right across that little fence back there. So we know that this area works and that property right there, the yellow one, was sold last year, turned into an Airbnb, and it's now one of the highest earning properties in our DNA. Okay? So we know this community works. We know this area works. There's no HOAs, no regulations. Again, sorry, I don't have a gimbal. But what we're looking at this house is, do we have enough square footage? Do we have enough rooms? Do we have a private pool? These are the things that we've identified in this market to be the most profitable. When it comes to competition, most of the Airbnbs out there do have one to two bedrooms or even just studios or private rooms, okay? So that being said, let's go ahead and take a look at this home. Right at Parkview State, come in, we see a living room and a kitchen in the middle of the house and some living areas back here. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we have right here, the kitchen. I'm looking for some switches. Get this going on, this party started. Okay. What do we have here? An utility room, that's what it looks like. Okay, converted garage. So this used to be a garage. Here's the utility, here's your water heater, and they created a bathroom. So here's one bathroom, toilet. It's a full bath, it's a small one. And then we go back here, and we have that attic bathroom, that converted garage which also has glass in a private entry. Now, this is a double wet pen window. I don't think it's an impact window. But so it's being used as an office right now. And of course we have access to the outdoor and a electrical panel right here. So let's walk this back. We have the kitchen area. We have a dining room Again, some more. These are single pen windows. Double. And we have the patio, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to come out here. Because it looked like a more updated, upgraded patio. Sometimes what I like from these homes is when I'm buying a, a more upgraded pool like this. This is a blue Marquis. That is the texture foundation of this pool. It's got nice tile. It seems like it's a more recent pool, probably about three to five years old, if not even more recent. And they extended the pavers out and created a fireplace. So this is really nice. All you have to do is come over and finish off that vinyl fence, provide the privacy you need to these property, maybe even save some of these plants. And you have a little paradise here to swim into. So this is really nice, really cozy. I have to double check the price, but I believe this house is listed at 525. Okay, and again, it's got four bedrooms, which is a major plus for our Airbnbs. Since we do like to have that extra amount of space, that extra ability to bring more people to our house. Okay, so here's bathroom number two. It's a bathtub, it's gonna need some work. And the bathroom's not remodeled. Again, this is a master bathroom. Usually I like my masters to have just a little bit more character. We're not gonna open up any um, doors. I don't wanna see the, all the sellers uh, clothing. So we're gonna leave the closets alone and all these spaces. But here's a third bathroom. This is good. This can help your cash flow to have the extra bathroom mirror. Interesting. I wonder if this is looking, if this looks on the other side. And this is a little bit more updated here in this one. 
So, third room, room number three. Okay. And fourth and last room. Okay. All right. All the windows throughout the house are the same. And uh, here's some of your attic entrance, and I'm sure there might be, might be one on the other side of the house where we just came in from. All right, so I hope you like this tour. I hope you like this video. Leave me a like, a subscription, and if you have any questions, don't forget to reach out. I focus and specialize on short-term rental investments, investments, and I can really save you time, money, and a lot of headaches if you decide to work with me. All right, Luis Pedoya, Charles with Realty, saying goodbye. See you in the next. Bye-bye.